So, week one challenges. One of them is to eliminate five players with a mythic or exotic weapon. So here's a simple approach that might help you if you're finding this one a little challenging. There are various ways which I'll cover, um, but the one I tried worked out pretty well for me. So, what we're going to do is land near Steamy Springs. I've marked that on the map for you. So here, Peely sells what I think is the only exotic weapon that you can buy in the game. And it's the Shadow Tracker, which is a silence pistol that marks the enemy um, once you've actually hit them. So here we are. Let's just open these chests and take what we can get. There's Peely. So let's go and... Uh, Get the shadow tracker from him. Just smash some stuff up here. Why not? Okay, now before we actually start and do that, there is another way, and that's to use a mythic weapon. What you can do is you can get into a vault and you can take any of the mythics that are in the vault. So what you have to do is kill the boss, get the card, Take out any enemy players that might be lurking while you're trying to do that. Look after your teammates if they get knocked. Um, once you're in the vault and you're out, you can take something like the Mythic MK, which is absolutely awesome weapon. And with it, you can kill people. It absolutely shreds, as you can see here. If you got this in the end game, it's a winner. So in an earlier game, I managed to get the charged shotgun of somebody. And so I use this uh, to eliminate a player. Okay, and then I noticed, okay, I've got four more to get. What's an easy way to do that? Back to Peely. So, buy the shadow tracker from Peely. As you saw there, I didn't actually pick it up. So my top tip if you're doing this challenge is to remember to pick it up. I do actually remember to pick it up. I'm just distracted at the moment because I'm just a thick fish. Oh, yep. Off a geyser or geezer. I'm British. I can't even remember what I say anymore. I've been in America so long. Um, but get the shadow tracker. Now, the other thing is I'm in squads and I'm in solo squads. Now, I need four more limbs, so I'm in solo squads because I reckon I'm just going to run into a bot squad and I can nail all four of them with the Shadow Tracker and then the challenge is done and that's easy peasy lemon squeezy. So there's a bounty board here, um, but before that, oh, I think I heard somebody on a zip line. There's somebody down there. Let's go and have a look. Oh, yep, there is somebody down there. That looks like somebody who doesn't even have a gun. So that's clearly a bot. Old water bottle 28. Okay. So the good thing about doing this in squads is you can knock people with any weapon. And then you can eliminate them with the shadow tracker. So can get this guy down here. Bender. And he's knocked and I can eliminate him later with the shadow tracker, which I will do now. Beautiful. This guy knocked. Okay. Mm, I don't know where the other squad member is. That was three. One missing. All right, we'll just go and find somebody. Somebody else. Now, uh, Peely's near two bounty boards. So there's one at Steamy Springs as well. This is telling me there's somebody in Mega City. So I'm going to head there. All right, I can hear shooting already. and see if we can third party a bot fight maybe we'll just get this last limb and then our challenge is done okay this looks like a good candidate he's not looking at me oops finish him off well that was easy wasn't it so if you found that useful why not like and subscribe 
If people enjoy these, I'm happy to make more of them. That's it for now. Bye-bye.